Good Wednesday morning, Steer Nation. Uh, it's April 22nd, 2020. Uh, let's just jump right into it. I got two big shout outs today. The first goes to uh, John Sparks and his maintenance crew, and specifically those guys that work on the grounds. I know I have given them a shout out before, but um, driving around uh, our campuses and, and observing all of our facilities, I just cannot help but notice how good our grounds look, uh, how well kept all of our facilities are, and that doesn't happen by accident. So uh, all of you guys that work on the maintenance and grounds crew for Mr. Sparks, thank you. We definitely appreciate <clears throat> and see what you're doing for our school district. Second shout out goes to Mike Ritchie, our outstanding high school principal and athletic director. Yesterday, in case you missed it on the Big Spring ISD Facebook page, uh, Mr. Ritchie, with the help of several of his outstanding teachers, put together a very inspirational video that was directed towards the students of Big Spring High School. If you hadn't had a chance to check that out, uh, I invite you to go do that because it's very, very well worth the watch. Um, <clears throat> thank you, Mr. Ritchie. Thank you, teachers, for taking the time uh, to give an inspirational message to our kids. Um, yesterday, I did listen to the governor's press conference. There was not a whole lot of new information as it pertained to uh, Big Spring ISD, but I do want everybody in the community to realize that he has uh, set his next press conference for Monday, April the 27th. Uh, he does plan on uh, issuing another executive order. Uh, he did hint that he would uh, be loosening some of the restrictions in his plan to reopen the economy in the state of Texas and in Howard County. Um, so I do think that will be very, very well worth the watch next Monday. I know I'll be tuning in. And a lot of what he does on these restrictions does affect Big Spring ISD. <clears throat> because when you look at, for example, moving forward with our graduation for the seniors of 2020, um, right now, even if we wanted to have a graduation uh, on May 22nd, and do it somehow in person because of the executive order that the governor gave right now, we could not do that. But I feel like that in the next, whether it be Monday or in the next two or three weeks, uh, we will have a little more direction on when and if we can have some type of in-person graduation and not do a virtual um, because Right now, uh, here at Big Spring ISD, we are not planning on doing any type of virtual graduation. We want to do something to where we can actually do it in person. It may be a little different than what we're used to, and more than likely, it'll probably be uh, held uh, at Memorial Stadium where we're outside in the nice, uh, clean air, and we got plenty of space, plenty of room. But uh, just know that we are still working on those plans. We're not ready to just cancel the date yet or set another state, uh, date uh, until we have more direction. But just know we are working on that and because you, the senior class of 2020, deserves that. And <clears throat> we're trying to do whatever we can do to make it a special occasion for you. Um, Finally, uh, we are continuing, obviously, uh, giving instruction to your kids. We had a great turnout on the packet pickup on Monday and the uh, packet turn-in on Monday. Uh, there will be some more information uh, in terms of grading and assessment uh, that we will finalize this Friday after I meet with our principals. And uh, just be looking for that to be released so everybody will know um, where we're coming from on grading and assessment and where we're heading uh, as we plan on reopening school in the school year of 2020-2021. Because I cannot wait to do that. I cannot wait to see the kids and the teachers because it's going to be a great day and a great time when that does happen. Uh, so just be looking for that early, early next week. 
I hope everybody has a great day. I hope you remain positive. Stay steer strong. We're all going to get through this together. Go steers.